Professor David Feynman, director of the National Center for Solar Energy, has developed a new type of solar power that may be the answer in the future to a possible world crisis when oil runs out. Feynman's method is cheap to run and if adopted by countries in the region, solar power plants will replace fossil fuel plants. It's photovoltaic technology, but the achievement is that we separate out the collection function of a photovoltaic cell to the light conversion to electricity function. And we collect the light, instead of using a huge area of solar cells, we use an equal area of cheap glass mirrors. And they are curved in such a way as to concentrate the light onto a very small solar cell, the size of just one cell. And in this way, you concentrate the light a thousand times and you can get a thousand times more power. The average person who lives in a sunny area, um, perhaps the, the desert of uh, California or Texas or New Mexico, Nevada or Spain, Italy, south of France, North Africa, anywhere in the Middle East, would be able to put a dish in his garden about 10 square meters, that's about 3 meters by 3 meters, and generate most of the home's electricity needs. And for big power companies, utilities, they could build fields, tens of square kilometers, to provide large percentages of the country's electricity requirements. I think you can solve the energy problem of many countries, of essentially all sunny countries. While Middle East countries may disagree on many issues, the sun is something everyone shares.